Well, guys, you ask how close we are to agreeing on a budget deal. I'll say, based on today's heated exchange, it seems the two parties are not getting along at all. Listen to this. Why won't you come to my office and talk with me about it? Great. I'll meet you down there, Representative. I will be right there. Thank you. This is not political theater. And after that, you can hear House Speaker Charles McCall curse at the Democrats, saying they need to support the budget bill. You guys need to support this. This is bull and this exchange, all because the budget vote failed again today. After 11 years, members, I'm tired. I'm tired of gimmicks. I'm tired of political attacks from both sides, and I'm guilty of that too. I too, somewhat guilty of partisan politics, but today it's about doing what the state of Oklahoma needs us to do. And what the state of Oklahoma needs is a budget, something to fill the $215 million budget gap. It's important for the legislature to find a way to uh, find unity, both Republicans and Democrats to come together behind a plan. Because without that plan, lives, jobs, and critical services are at stake. And I'll tell you, just to be honest, this is one of the wildest days we have seen here at the state capitol. And guess what? We get to do it all over again in exactly 12 hours. They reconvene tomorrow at 10 a.m. Reporting live at the state capitol, Abigail Ogle, KOCO 5 News. <laughs>